Hi, I'm Dave Caddy, the food dude over here at American Pro Paint. Today with Becky Varner. We're doing from your table to your health. Fourth of July is coming up. Everybody's cooking out burgers, aren't they? They absolutely are, Dave. And How are you going to do it? Well, let me tell you. <laughs> we are going to make a healthy burger, number one. Not me. Oh, I know. <laughs> I need it more I'm than anybody. Gonna make a You're going to show me how to do it. I am. <laughs> and I'm going to show you. We're going to start out using lower fat ingredients. Okay. We're actually using for our healthier, lower fat burger, lower calorie burger, we're using okay. a 96% lean, 4% fat okay. hamburger. You're going to be using an 80 percent. Yeah, 80 lead 20, baby. And 20. Okay, that's now, right. and, and I use 80 20 because of the fat content that puts flavor back in. So you're using something leaner. So you've got to do something kind of special it's to a compensate. Secret. All right, it's a secret. Can you let us in on the secret? I guess I can. All right. All right. What we're going to do for years, people have used onion mm -hmm. to stretch meat. That's right. And also to flavor it. That's right. What we're going to do with our hamburger patty is we're making it into two very thin okay. flat discs. We're putting a big thick slice so it's of a onion double burger. in there. I like to think of it as a double burger. It is, it okay. is. But the final product is a very thick, okay. juicy, much lower fat, lower calorie burger. <laughs> well, it sounds great. I'm glad you like the idea. All right, so anything else we need to know? Like what other kind of like the condiments and things well, like that? Well, we are gonna use on the healthier burger, we're going to use a reduced fat cheese. It'll be okay. a 2% milk versus a whole milk okay. cheese. We are going to use a um, fat-free mayo okay. or mustard, and people okay. can use either. They both have about the same 15 calories, no sure. fat per okay. tablespoon. So we're going to use that. You'll be using the regular mayonnaise, I understand, on yours. Okay. Is that a fact? <laughs> of course, of course. <laughs> what else? And then we're going to have a lot of uh, vegetables. We're going to have a big uh, green leafy lettuce. You know, we focus on the darker the green right. of the vegetable, the greater the nutrient density. And the greater the flavor. The gra absolutely, absolutely. <laughs> and a big old thick juicy slice of tomato. Tomato, I love it. Yeah. They're really in season right now. They are. So good. Now what about the bun? And the bun, I'm glad you, you asked me about that. <laughs> We're going to be using a whole grain. Okay. It's, it's actually a whole wheat bun. Okay. It's got six grams of fiber per bun. And as you know, most Americans don't get enough fiber in their diet. That's right. So in addition to our hamburger being lower in fat, lower in calories, it's going to be higher in fiber. Okay. And you're going to be using a basic white flour refined. White bread. Yeah, there you All go. All right, very good. Well, it's enough talk. Let's do this. I'm ready. Let's do it. All right. <laughs> okay. All right, Becky, I hate to say it, but yours looks better than mine. <laughs> My burger is thicker than yours, isn't it? It is. All right, yeah. let's break this down. What, what are we doing here? What are we saving? Okay, here's what we're doing. We uh, have used mustard on mm -hmm. our bun, which, by the way, again, is a whole wheat mm -hmm. bun, so we have all that extra fiber. Mm -hmm. You're using the mayonnaise on that mm -hmm. one, and so that saves a lot of fat and mm -hmm. calories. We've loaded it with vegetables. We've got mm -hmm. a lot of extra green leaf lettuce, the tomatoes, and the cheese that we used is the reduced fat. Uh, so we save a little bit of fat there and some calories there. And then uh, remember our bun, uh, or our, our patty is a lot thicker because it's got that onion Absolutely. in there too. So all that flavor in there. Wow. Then in addition to that, Dave, um, I made a nice coleslaw. The recipe okay. of course will be in the column. It's a vinegar based coleslaw, delicious. Okay. You have french fries french on yours. Fries. Yeah, yeah, you got the fries there. Number one killer in America. There right. you go. There. <laughs> And then we have a nice little dessert. I've just taken some fresh strawberries, put okay. a few blueberries in there, mm -hmm. and then a little bit of fat-free vanilla yogurt just to drizzle over there. So you there. get dessert too? I don't even get dessert. You didn't get dessert. I am now so how much, sorry. How much, how much uh, calories did, did you save on your side? Well, almost, almost half. Almost, almost half the calories half and more than and half. And you get dessert. Yeah, well, and I fair. get dessert and a lot less than half of the fat. <laughs> so it's just amazing when you begin to look at a few differences. And I'll tell you what, I bet my burger's as good as yours. <laughs> what do you think? I, it sure looks like it. And I'll tell you, it's amazing. So 4th of July is coming up. You're doing your cookout. 
You can go fat burger like me, or you can go skinny burger like Becky. Either way, it's going to be delicious. Just to figure out, you know, everybody needs to take a look at what they're eating. It's very important, but uh, it's been a lot of fun. Thanks yeah. to Uptown Grocery for uh, supplying us with these wonderful ingredients today, and American Propane for supplying these great grills. It's been a lot of fun. Well, thank you, David. It's been fun for me, too. Happy 4th. Happy 4th to you. And same to you. <laughs> <laughs> All right.